this series. It's going to be Team Sir Lose a Lot versus Team Sir Callan. I apologize for the uh, stream title being incorrect. It's actually Team Sir Lose a Lot versus Team Sir Callan. Um, it will be a best of three. I don't know how many games are going to be in it, if it's going to be all, a play all three or, or not. But um, yeah, it should be a good game. It should be fun. Um, whenever you're ready, Joe, you can um, start the game. All right, awesome. So uh, we are both casting today. So Chosen is going to help me cast. Uh, my name is Cedruna Pickle, by the way. So we are going to be casting together just because it's been a while since I've done any casting. But yeah, so as we can see on both sides here. Oh my goodness, I've forgotten how to actually... Um, this is locked. There we go. As you can see on yep. both sides here, so on the blue team we've got, uh, not blue team, sorry. Uh, so for blue we've got, yeah. that's Russia, Sir German, Callan German. The German. Oh my god, I yep. called it Russia by accident. Uh, then we've yeah, got Swedes for, so Sir Callan isn't German, he's Dutch, no? Yeah, Sir Callan yeah. is German. Oh no, sorry, Sir, Sir Lose a Lot is German, I apologize. Yeah. <laughs> I was Sir Callan is Dutch. Um, yeah. And then we've right. got this is really WB scuffed. All as Ottomans, it's purple. Yep. Uh, Sir Callan is Dutch as yellow. And then, well, yeah. there we go, we've got, I can't say that name, uh, <laughs> as Swedes. How do you pronounce that? Schaff Seckel? Seven? Schaff Seckel? Schaff Schaff Seckel? Seckel? We'll go with Schaff. that. Yeah. Schaff Seckel. So a couple of people Seckel. are getting treasures, says Lose a Lot. Just gotten yeah. a uh, two cows, or no, a cow rather. Mm -hmm. Right. Um, so that's interesting. You don't really see them opening the, them getting that type of treasure this early. Very true. I'm gonna see a crack shot now on the uh, coyote pup. Nothing particularly uh, happening with explorers. It's a very large map, so. They're uh, being good sports. That's good. They are. We'd love to see that in the chat. All right. So that. it looks like Germany. Did they go market start? They went market looks start like, with a house. Yeah, okay, market start. Whereas mm -hmm. red and then um, top. Did um, autos go for um, a? Okay, no, so they just they went, went for, for a house post. and a, uh, a house and trade post. Right. So they're saving. Their uh, they they start with a. Uh, 400 wood, so they're just saving their extra wood. They're not doing mm -hmm. anything with it. That'll be interesting. Um, one thing to note to all those who are watching and uh, are viewing, there are uh, two tiers of sieves that they set out, the A tier and the B tier sieves, and they can only pick from a, a pool of... Um, they can only pick one from both pools, so there should be a lot of sieve diversity in this. Um, it's going to be, if it's a play, if, if all three games are played then um there should be six unique sieves from um each team so that'll be cool that would um, be cool indeed absolutely so uh, you wanna i think Hello? dex should be um around now it looks like they're looking at big treasures too as a team uh purple and yellow purple and yellow like right are grouped up there. with their explorers Yep, and then uh, oh, it looks like there might be an explorer fight sometime soon. They're gonna cross paths. Ooh, they're gonna. Okay, yeah. He, he runs away. He's probably calling his teammate right now. Um, he's gonna age up. Germany has been a little bit slow. He's paying attention. Okay, there you so go. So lose a lot of here. Um, so if this fight goes yeah. bad for, so it's a lot yeah, he's he's, 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 he's probably. Um, that's not good too because he needs to build a TP in transition. He's chopping. Although, um, so you want to check Dex really here. quick? Yeah, absolutely. So for uh, so lose a lot, he sent his two um, set okay. the wagons already. That is his deck. So quite a okay. strong. It H3, looks like relatively standard, right? Yep. Um, he doesn't have the five uh, five. Uh, what is it called? The, the five Ulans. I think that at least in DE, they the the pros have decided that that's not a good card anymore. Um, that's fair. I'll check and the then... well, so yeah. oh, it's taking a while to load. Oh, is it paused the? Can I not check other people's decks? 
Maybe. Oh, yeah. You might. You might have to move to. Yeah. Just. Uh. Just switch through people's. Not like so. How do I lose switch a lot through? And oh. Can, can, okay. 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 Yep. Sorry. And then you can just click there. Spectated. Okay. Yep. So three settlers coming in for. So it looks like they're going for age three play. Both of them have a lot more cards in age three than they have in age two. But I guess that's pretty standard for um, a Swedish player and a German player. Um. Yeah, he's about to lose his floor, which is very painful, but that's okay. Um, so Germany did get a TP up. They sacrificed the Swedish for, for the German in getting his TP. Um, it looks like uh, they're going to... Um, Otto's is going to try and do a uh, Bado FF, uh, as people call it. Yeah, he's just sending 700 gold first. Um, yeah, so they should also be going semi-greedy. Um, ooh, so it's one bank than a, than a barracks. That's going to be uh, semi-aggressive, uh, maybe. It's, he's probably going to three-bank boom and then maybe age up, if I had to guess. Um, he's uh, prepared for some pressure, though, if it does come. Um, this is about the time the two lawns come into somebody's helps. base and... And, uh, and uh, yeah, so that's a interesting... I, I would strongly say don't do that but you know this guy he's uh he's i guess they don't have a whole bunch of anti-cav i i don't prefer um they do uh, have a Otto, Otto's uh, the, yeah. I, I don't prefer janissaries for anti-cav i just feel like they're not super great but i'm that just might be a, a preference not super uh, correct um We've got more set yeah. wagons coming in. Or... What's this uh, Dutch's deck look like? You can kind of tell by a Dutch deck whether or not they're going to be uh, aggressive or not. Okay, so he only has one bank card, and I, I don't appreciate that very much, but it's okay. Um, because if he sends the church card, then it'll be all right, I guess. So he sent 700 wood. One bank, he's playing super standard right now. Um, where are those two Ulans at? They should be around. Ulans, should be raiding uh, with those as Germany. Okay, Ulans he's got four out. out. That's uh, that's too bad. It's, a, and it's like the yeah, Disney show, I'll The Bad back. Batch. Okay, there are the two. It seems slow, but I might be wrong. I feel like at about 5.30 they should be coming out. Um, We've got some Carolians out as well in the forward base. Yep. Now, Caroline. Ottomans just managed to go um, yep. age free. So yep. if they can uh, hold that, five um, janissaries that are about to pop it'll be up. good. Yeah, I don't like that. I think if he's going a halbs, I think a great combo here. Uh, you can abuse the fact that they really have to like push in on the halbs. Just go abyss, bro. There, uh, you have two coin mines in base. You have four thousand coin. Like you don't really need. Like against Carolines, like bro, what are they gonna do? You have you have Caroline, uh, Caroline, um, and uh, Ulan. Like, how are they gonna get through Halb? Um, it does Halb, seem Halb like, is, like they've not got a lot of. Uh, I don't know. I don't think their deck is very centered around uh, Abus, especially where they've got the Riding School card. It seems like they're gonna go more for well, um, for a stable soon or something. Yeah. You can see I, Ottomans building another town center. Yeah, so he sent he sent the TC card, and now he's going to build a, a TC. So he's going to be very greedy. Um, it looks like uh, blue and red are not going to be very happy about that, but that's all the way... Oh, no, those two Ulans on the on the side might be able to figure out that there's a TC going up there. Oh, and then that... It, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't be surprised if they just kind of went and killed that. They don't have a whole lot out. Uh... It's interesting that they are really not committing to the. Uh... But I, I that's really bad in my opinion, aging up with the halb because then you don't have your four hundred wood. That's just so slow as Dutch. I don't know. Might He's a lot be better than me, I guess. Sure um, this is going to be a decent raid. raid. He, he's getting them low. He can go in for another raid later, and those guys will be already low. Be good. Um, okay, 600 wood coming in from the Dutch player. It looks like Germany is ready to go up. Let me check chat. Um, I will get the Civ tiers out right in a second, and I'll put those up. Give me a second, chat. So we can see a, a raid here. 
not really going to do anything other than stop sets from going all time, but a new alarm goes down. We also see that, oh, this could be big actually. That TC's not gone up yet, and there's a decent mass of Carolines there that are going to do. Um, they're not going to take the TC down, but they're going to do a few thousand damage before it goes up. So in chat, I just posted the A tier sieves and the B tier sieves. Um, you guys, uh, I'll actually clear. Um... Do you guys think that these are all uh, B tier sieves? Oh That's a much goodness, better question than asking if they should be in A tier. But they're yeah, I, like raid. I said, I thought that they would go for that uh, that TC on the side, um, a big raid. If that's good. At the moment, um, there's a lot of pressure being applied from both sides did, of the map. Yeah. Did Germany ever click up? Uh, let's have a look. Oh, they did, yes. So they're now okay. age 3. Okay, that's and good. Right as I say see, that, well. We can see that the age up is coming for Sweden as well, but no so age up yet for Sir Callum's the... Dutch. It looks like their greed has paid off. They're, they're coming ahead and score just slightly, and it looks like it'll keep on going. Um, really what Swede needs to keep on doing Come is, uh, on, yeah. they're doing a good job of it too, is just keep on torping those those coin mines. That's pretty much for all you need as Swedes are torps. They're, they're on, insane. Um, oh, uh, the skirmishers get caught out here by the Ulan. Yeah, that's that's very uh, the that's not good. Not gonna the Halb is going to do some more. I mean, There's two Halbs is actually... Really strong, but um, yeah, they against doing actually Mulan, work, I guess yeah. against yeah, those those halves actually saved them. Yeah, I think they lost like three skirm for for two Ulan and and half HP on a on a halb that's decent. Commando. Yeah. Um, Not a bad trade. I'm surprised that Germany hasn't tried to go for the the middle uh, TP. I think uh, it used to be in the older game, whoever got the middle TP first usually usually won the game. Um, just so good. Let's see, um, okay, so they're just taking map control, and it looks like purple is hugging the wall really, really hard. Um, let's check, um, uh, can you look at Swede's perspective? They're, uh, okay, yeah. He's, so again, uh, Baron Karelian's coming in. No, 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 but it looks like he has full, uh, pop for, um, for... His houses, so that's interesting. I, I'm a little bit disappointed he didn't send the uh, team uh, coin mine. Uh, it's so strong, in my opinion. Yeah, this if one? you send that, it, it increases the yield, and you just have an extra Here's four thousand coin amongst yourself. Like as Germany, that's so strong. I that feel like they missed the opportunity before. sending that, but it's okay. You know, I, they they aren't me. Um. I do feel like so, with this big a uh, mass, they're looking to be a lot more aggressive and end the game early. We do see a lot of Ulans going down there to the Janissary. Uh, and they've got some cavalry archers as well from Ottomans there. Uh, as well, some war wagons. This is looking like, just from a first glance, that this is going to be going favorably for uh, blue and red. Let's uh, lose a lot's team. We're gonna get more here just because the army mass is larger. But we'll see. We do see some torps going down though in the top side of the map, and some Caribbeans are going to engage those halves. But a fight is going to start. You can see the halves are moving that. into position. Those halves are doing some work, uh, being annoying. That's always a good thing to see. Um, okay. Something that'll be interesting to see if that ever happens is, uh, uh Insta War Wagons. That, that would be pretty fun to see on this map if it goes late. We do see uh, that Halbraid. Uh, yeah. The units go down because of the Carolians. There is a very big Carolian mass if you look at combining them across the map. That's yeah, amazing. they, uh, can you, uh, figure out, like, can you, uh, control shift A and figure out how many Carolians there are, or no? Doesn't let me. It's a shame. Oh, that's true. But I'd imagine okay. Vils minus population, if we say that these are 8 pop, 
and then 32. There's probably about 60 Karelians right now. Um, yeah, that's a lot. Map, which is a lot. And this is probably yeah. a massive amount. Of people, so 25, 30. And then the rest yeah, of they're doing here. A... Oh, we actually see an engagement they're doing... going on here too. They're doing a really good job of containing. They're taking the map as needed, like as uh, as Germany and as Swedes. If you can take over the mines, like you can just do so much. And if Otto's is three TC booming, you really want to place those TCs a little bit more aggressively. At least in my opinion, you could even send. Uh, um, you could send the age one card that makes your uh, TC fire faster. And uh, what's it called? My goodness. The Minutemen and the TC firing. Yeah, the, yeah, the, yeah, uh, yeah, what's that called? I can't it's... remember. <laughs> Mil but that's colonial a, Militia it's a good card. or something, no? Yeah, no. Colonial no. Militia, yeah. yeah. Yeah, CM. Bro, if you, if you, if as, uh, autos you have CM in your deck and you just place your TCs a little bit more aggressively, especially if he's already gonna build four, I feel like you take a lot more map control and you can, like, uh, f find raids more. I do like the decision to make, uh, Bow Rider, I think they're, uh, very underrated as a as a unit. Absolutely, and I think they'll be very useful against the the uh, war wagons and ulans. I think yeah. that the biggest worry right now is will Otto be able to scale? They did just lose yeah. two TCs. They lost a large portion of this map, which is now going to go to um, yeah. the blue and red. So, it's oh, not you see another engagement good. here, and actually, yeah. those Carolines are kind oh, of that's, cool. Oh, that's that's a yeah. Caroline should the big button and run away. Um, I'm thinking, um, what what are the resources that are being stacked on every every side? You want to want to look through really yep. quick. So for Germany, they have a little bit more food. Um, if they've got about a thousand. Oh wow! Sweden, okay, Sweden they is, might is, be looking is, to. Is okay, they look like they're gonna age. They do look yeah. like they will age. They've got the highest score in the game. Uh, we do actually see got some of these cows trying to take torps, and there's a large mass here. If these skirmishes get caught, it's game over, but we'll see. Yeah, that's, um... Ooh, ooh, this is not good. Oh, those cannons. Wow, those that's cannons nice are doing volley. work. That's that a good volley, a, yeah. That is another big and, volley. Uh, getting I, a lot of HP. I don't think, unless they make their own artillery foundry, that those are those cannons are really ever going to go down. If they uh, have their explorer around, they can get that XP treasure, and it's just going to be really strong. That's right true. now, um, uh, Dutch is trying to pop out of... Th Three um, um, artillery, uh, military buildings. Okay, he's gonna get it. We do see the age four good. for uh, Sweden. Right. So, you're gonna so see he some... did click that up. Is he? St he's still at pop max pop. That's interesting. Okay, let's uh, let's look at uh, autos and uh, Dutch. What are what are their research? Okay, so Dutch they're doing. Uh, they're not stacking a whole lot. Autos is. That's interesting. He's almost popped. Yeah, he needs some houses. Really bad. And he's yeah. chopping his autos. That just kind of hurts to, you know, you, you don't want to have to do that too much. But I guess it's later in the game. That's not too but, so Germany skirmishes are um, currently fighting with Dutch skirmishes. Yeah, I don't those think are in this. Like, these guys. What are what are, okay, what are what's the HP and uh, attack on the Dutch skirm? Dutch skirm is twenty. Uh, okay, so they're almost exactly the same. Oh no, yeah. never mind. Never mind. Just That's what doing. Yeah, they have one card on them. Ooh, we might. One or two. If, if the Dutch skirmishers mis mis misposition here, like the Falconets will take them out. So they have to be really careful. Yeah, place. they, um. I think that, uh, Swedes is stacking so much gold. He makes artillery foundry, makes like three more cannons. And, uh, I don't think they have any answer to this. I don't think Dutch will make any artillery. That's very true. This is not. This is not too. looking good. I think Sir Callan and uh, Shaftskelo will uh, be uh, in the upper hand as of right now. Again, to all those that are just tuning in, the uh, the the teams are incorrect, as you can probably tell. Uh, you guys are very smart people. Uh, it is uh, Team Sir Lose a Lot versus Team Sir Callan. So, uh, forget about the Team Kaiser versus Team Kinesi. It's not a Kaiser um, game, unfortunately. That would have been fun to cast. But... Yeah. I think I believe Harrison casted that yesterday or the day before, and that should have been a good game. He's a good caster, I'm not surprised. Yeah, Harrison is awesome.
So, um, I do see, like, Sir Callan's musketeers here are doing a lot of work. I'm just very worried because the moment that they get hit by a falconet volley, they're gonna take a lot of damage. You mean your scrim? You yeah, mean, you mean his scrim? Scrim. You said, yes. okay. yep. What did I say? Uh, you said Nusk, but it's okay. Musk. I think that, so, one thing, uh, can you look at the res from Sir Callan? He needs to get... Uh, he needs to get age four, and he needs to send. Um, he needs to send heavies. He he needs heavies, and then he can send the bank. Uh, no, sorry, not the bank card, but the uh, the church card, and then he can send. Um, he can uh, macro all gold. He could get. Uh, oh wow, he is, is splitting looking, really well. This is looking really favorable now, just because of how well the skirmishes are taking out the Caribbean yeah, and the Neroises as well. They took out the Falconets. So yeah. the Falks are down. It's this is cool. a very, very good fight for them. Unfortunately, though, you can see there's not a lot of resources for Sir Callan, so that age four we're talking about might not be for a while. But we do see both blue and red. They age to four. They've got a factory and everything, yeah. so... This, um... I mean, that was a really poor fight. I think all, the, all Sir Callan needs to do is ship heavies. Um, have a... Uh, uh, both of them ship heavies. They can go a little bit harder into anti cab just to make sure. Um, I think they make a bunch of scrim, and I think it'll be all right. Um, uh, just because of how high their score lead is, this is the time to push though, as um, as uh, as purple and uh, yellow. They really need to get something done, or else they're going to lose just because of score and the eco lead that they have. Uh, Otto's is like fully on wood. That's interesting. It looks like he's probably going to try to uh, uh, transition to mills and plantations. Um, also seeing the from the Carolians. Yeah, he's, uh, he's doing a well. Yeah, he's those those Carolians are dead already, but he might as well um, uh, trade those off. Um, they just have such a map presence, like, uh, since, like, minute eight, um, Sweet has pretty much had uncontested, uh, full pop of, um, all the mines are about to run out, so that will be a huge power, like, uh, not spike, but, like, decline, uh, the, the trough of power spike will be gone, or will be there. I think those um, rooms are doing a bit of work. I mean, they're not really known for yeah. being able to deal that much damage to, uh, to infantry, but there go free skirmishers. Yeah, and... they just updated uh, uh, oh, Holgren to being good against uh, uh, against uh, buildings now. They 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 do a hundred damage to buildings now, which is uh, very very good. Um, they are still like not good. They're they're meant to be anti artillery, but yes, they're very strong now. That's good. We'd love to see that. I I, uh, I appreciate Colvern's being buffed because they haven't been buffed. I don't think ever in this entire game until just recently. I could be wrong on that though. So, right. so we are seeing a very large scale. Uh, oh, walls are going up. Ooh, that's interesting. Um, oh, that's a decent ra Oh, okay, so uh, purple is switching to Huss. That's a decent idea. Okay, he did decide. I oh, said that Sir Luzelot had to um, had to send heavies, and then I think they would be all right. So he did that. He took my advice. He's insane. Um, it looks like uh, he is idle quite a bit. Eight villager idle. You hate to see it, but uh, that's in the town center. But yeah, it's the town center. Um, so that would be kind of a disappointing loss, but it did a very good job of denying that to the TP and that, uh, that coin mine and uh, some hunts there. So even if they do die, I think it'll have served its purpose. And really, they're soaking up a lot of units from somewhere that it's really there's nothing really happening on that side. This is about to be a main fight. I don't like. I don't like that TC going down by uh, or purple trying to get that TC down. I think he needs to come back. Those Hussar and. Uh, Everything uh, I think are going to be uh, very important, and now those uh, preemptive culverin are going to pop. They do very well. Um, I think Sir Callan. Um, can you check his resources? Okay. What about Sir Luzlot? 
So Luzalot is doing relatively well. He's actually at 77 villages. He, he does well. not have his factories up for him, which is very disappointing. He Doesn't, needs to send yeah. that shipment very soon. He's uh, he's being not super. Uh... Oh, the heavy cannons go down. Okay, so the heavy is more. down. That is uh, not good. But I mean, they're just so far ahead at this point. I don't know how they uh, they win. I think they could pretty much lose their entire armies and they'd still be okay. That's a big. This is looking. Volley. Yeah, I I would love to see uh, age uh, age four from autos send uh, team. Uh, Team, um, uh, what are they called? Sfahi? And, uh, and I think that that would do well. Okay, but yeah, he's just charging in. He's going all in. Yep, okay. So, yep. yep, the resign, the resignation is true. So, um, yeah, what does he mean by, uh, WB? I, I don't. WB? I thought it was well played, it's but like P. W WB? Yeah, that's weird. It's interesting. I don't know. Just doing okay, so that is here. that is game one. Uh, Sir Kallen and Shkashkfakel. Um, they take the uh, not take the lead. One zero. Unless Sir lose a lot. Takes Sir lose a lot. I apologize, bro. Having two Sirs. I know that's confusing, uh, right? So you got Sir lose a lot. You got Sir right. Kallen. They should have been on the same team. Yeah. I don't know why they weren't. Yeah, they would have been the Sirs. All right. All right. Yeah, the Sir oh. team. Fun game. But uh, that that was a very very good game. Um, on to the next. No, his name, um, Glycia, or Glyca, I, I apologize if I pronounced your name wrong, um, is GG WB all. So I think it means something. Oh, I have GG no idea. GG WB, right? Like, he's yeah. only saying GG to one person? Yeah. This is, oh, it's a, so this is going to be a. I've never uh, seen this map. Ooh. Thank wow. you, Brem uh, Hoke, for uh, rating us with a party of three. I appreciate it. Um, okay, so it's going to be a sieve and mirror. That is extremely interesting. Um, we will uh, see who plays uh, better. This is going to be a, a true uh, test of uh, skill. I'm surprised they didn't. Uh, this seems this map seems like the map to veto these days. Nobody really wants to play on it. But uh, apparently they do. Um, it'll I've be never seen so, this map. so they vetoed. Uh, yeah, this is Siwa Oasis. It has Berbers and it has um, and it has uh, Dervisher or uh, Sudanese, I believe. Yeah, Ber so it's got Berbers. And then what's the other side? Uh, the other okay. one is Sufi. Yes. Okay, Sufi. Okay. So, um, that oh, is Berbers recently added. I, I, not, I haven't played in like so a year, they, guys. No, so the, the Berbers are, are, are pretty old. They used to be really good, but now they are nerfed. Um, uh, I don't think that there will be a whole lot of uh, native play, uh, but I could be wrong. There are two Frances after all. Um, if they do, I, I wouldn't be surprised if they just used it for the extra five vills. Okay, so he's got. Okay, that is very interesting. He has a team early skirm. Um, I don't really like that, India. especially when you have a India on your team. Like you can already go Gurkha, so maybe he's just trying to do it because you get um, faster train time as India. I don't know. Um, yeah, yeah, that's a, what I'm, I'm it's thinking. A, it's, a, it's a twenty percent build time increase, which is actually pretty decent. I don't know. Maybe somebody in the chat will know. Um, if you send that card, does it make your your Gurkha instant? Um, like with all the other cards and the uh, and the tech. Uh, yeah, I believe probably not. But I do not main India very much. I have it's very minus little twenty percent build time. Yeah, that's so, pretty strong. I feel like with all right. Church we, up, do they have like a church upgrade um, like Europe does, where it also reduces? And like, do they have something in the I monastery? I think they do. I think that's only for um, European civs. China. I think China has the ability to get that, but I could be wrong. I don't know. Okay. Because um, they only have like a card to reduce. Trends. So let's look at the deck differences. So that's Sir Callan. What's a uh, what's Shkashkifel? So his he's got no okay. early skirmishes or very, natives. Very different. So he um he looks like he's going to. Um, probably, uh, 
either Samwise build or just a uh, five hus semi. Uh, that looks a lot like he's going to try and go at age three as fast as possible. He's actually um, about to or, start aging too. As fast as reasonable. It looks like they're okay. So they have aggros on either side. That's extremely uh, interesting. Aggro on that side and aggro on that side. That's super funny. Um, so they're gonna just control uh, either side of the map. I think that it might just end up being uh, a game, kind of like uh, uh, whoever rushes first might just win because the other, because uh, you just have the map control. So it's looking interesting um okay that's a lot of coin from gg um wb all um okay let's look at sir cal okay sir calland's debt uh, sorry sorry, I'm, sir like I'm sorry that yeah that's my bad that's yeah my these bad. guys no you're good um so, it's pretty standard in yeah. terms of cards that have been yeah, sent everyone sent the same cards each other. pretty standard he's got the infinite yurumi he's got gurkha he does not have the team upgrade for stuff, but that's interesting. Yeah, but that's a decent uh, deck overall. I, I like that deck. Um, yeah, it'll just be interesting. I think uh, my bet is whoever rushes is probably going to win. Um, you just want to apply pressure on this map, take over. It's so low hunt that whoever really does well um controlling the other people's hunts is probably going to win now i know especially with india on your team you're not going to need nearly as much food because you can chop for your bills um but yeah this will be interesting there are no tps besides uh native tps there's no tp line i apologize i should have said that first aid drop is about to complete so we're gonna see uh oh look. To you, brand new, uh, it is incorrect. It is not Harrison as a caster. It is myself. I'm a sketchy pineapple here. Um, and it will be Sejuan a pickle. Sejuan a pickle. But Sejuan a yeah. pickle works too. It's Wuna. Yeah. But yeah, uh, yeah. My Sej name's literally Sejuan just Joe. I am in a royal clan and I used to cast a lot and then I kind of stopped playing the game for a while. Uh, so I have no idea about what's changed, but I still know the base game, if that makes sense. But, yeah. Um, that's why um, I have a co-caster today. <laughs> so. answer, answer you, Evolution. It is not a uh, all matches mirror. They just decided on a mirror, I, I guess. Uh, it'll be very interesting to see. Um, so it looks like the score lead... Oh, it's almost exactly the same, but uh, Sir Callan is doing a much better job uh, uh, having a score. He's got almost a thousand score lead on the other French player. So it's interesting to see the, the, see a house the difference in build. Yep, the house going down is uh, painful. Um, it looks like the walls being built has really slowed him down from what he would really like to be doing. I don't actually like the hus, uh, hus start. Sure I think you want to go. S I think you just really oh, want to FF as fast as possible and then go um, probably uh, Sepoy uh, Skirm or, or Sepoy Goon or, or maybe Goon uh, Gurkha. But I don't like the hus start very much. I do just want but... to really quickly mention that there was a treasure here. And uh, I think it was over a hundred wood that uh, Sir Lucy just got, which is quite a big treasure. But yeah, it's not quite there a are a answer, lot of just because of the pressure here. There are a lot of big treasures on this map, but I think that um, if there isn't pressure applied quickly, I think it's uh, pretty much this type of map is the type of map you just base trade on. You know, you uh, you kind of have to, especially with India, you you're taking over either side of the map you really have to rush the other side looks like sir Collins doing a good job i like the crossbow um musk way better than going uh cavalry um sepoy are just so strong he is cleaning it up that is uh very uh good for him you see both of these bases are holding off very well i think that the house going down. I'm not sure if any of the uh, Courier de Bois went down. I'm not sure if either team took like more damage than the other, to be honest. 
think the idling is the biggest issue. Um, yeah, so that so that should answer your question, Harrison. Um, thank you for changing the uh, title. I appreciate that. Uh, I hope that if you uh, did, you yeah. I hope your stream went well. Um, this is game two of the series. Um, Sir lose a lot and uh, Gefell or Skash Skaf. Cycle. I don't even know. Um, he uh, is. Uh, they have a 1 0 lead. It looks like uh, Alaska was vetoed for the map. I appreciate the kind words, Slan. Um, all right. I do you see Gurkha that are being made by. Uh, so I lose a lot as blue, but we don't see Gurkha coming out from. Oh, we only see Sepoy still. So purple's still going for Sepoy. We're actually seeing um there seems to be like a little raid here. Maybe just some recon. Yeah, um He has that. That's interesting. Um they are very low on eco it seems. I uh I dislike Hmm. This is interesting. Uh, the scores seems are very like, similar. It seems like both uh, India players are very low in uh, resources, whereas the France players yeah. have a nice stop. It looks fire. like they both might be kind of flirting with the idea of aging up. I, I do not like just sacking all the uh, Sawar. Um, that's uh, very uh, disappointing. Those Vils might be tanking at some point. That's uh, you don't really want to be attacking French Vils, especially in a fight. They're just gonna soak all that damage. Um, let's look down at uh, blue and red fighting. Uh, that's about it's to happen. I think purple just kind of got uh, uh, moved out. Um, he's doing a good job of microing his husk to where they aren't really in hand attack with the sepoy, so that's good. Okay, uh, blue and red. That's gonna be a huge fight. Is he running his vills? Yes, he is Seems running his vills. That's like interesting. Fight will start in just a moment. Mm -hmm. That um, is a shit. Sir Callan. Sir Callan does have the. Oh, never mind. His, uh, he clicked up. That's why his score went down so drastically. Uh, Sir lose a lot. Uh, is uh, doing well with his score though. Um. This is about the time I would chop a little bit of wood, especially if I was uh, starting to stack a little bit of food and uh, and get that uh, Berber TP, and then I would have the opportunity to uh, have a decent anti-cab if I needed, uh, and then I would have the opportunity to train another five builds. So if I wanted to like start booming a little bit, because it looks like at least as, as green, there isn't going to be a whole lot more pressure being applied that will be super uh, impactful. Uh, okay, it looks like green is sending a raid down. You want to look at that uh, green right there? Yep, he's sending uh, three huts just to be annoying. That's uh, and uh, purple is sending his army back. That is interesting. That's a that's a good play from. Uh, from green, if he's able to make an entire army idle just for three husks, that's super good. So we do um, see three of the husks are coming in. Uh, again, I can't say his name either. Uh, Shaft Snickle. But uh, it seems like this push is now going to be negated just by Sir Callum alone. The yeah. mass. I think that when you're defending in early fights, the town center plus the Minutemen makes such a big difference. And I think that Musketeer hey, and we? Crossbowman was such a good choice here for allowing him to just kind of win that fight. You can see that there is a big mass difference. But we are seeing Soar come in now from so lose a lot. We'll see Go how on. those perform. Mm -hmm. Um to all those asking, I apologize we don't have a scoreboard up. It is uh one zero to uh Sir, Lu Sir Lose a lot and uh, Scaf or Scaf Seckle. Uh, oh, we do see some. I, I have a very hard time. 
It's very hard so. to say. Just say it as how you think it is, right? <laughs> yeah. Um, the scores are pretty even. It looks like Red is starting to take the lead as well. Uh, this is just... its I, I like mirrors. Uh, not necessarily because they're super diverse, but just because you can see, like... Um, it brings really out the skill. Like, uh, you just have to be so skilled to win a, a mirror, especially at this high level. Um, it just takes a uh, three vil raid, and, and you're just so behind sometimes. You know, it's uh, it's really interesting just to see how uh, how uh, it works. Okay, he's about to lose um, uh, a few vils. It looks like he's going to trade some uh, some pass for vils. So he gets three uh, goons out. Uh, but he's losing some houses. That is, uh, you don't want to see that. It's, uh, it's annoying to be popped. He's, uh, almost at, uh, the top of Oh, uh, so that's red, I apologize. You want to look at, um, what's in the other, uh, We do see purple retreating from green space, but currently this Agra is under siege. Yeah, if that aggro goes down, that is huge. It's just so much map control that it will not be there anymore. Nice volley onto the well. uh, yeah. Both uh, both French players are up, and it looks like uh, um, both uh, India players are almost exactly the same score, so they're doing very, very well. Um, it looks like Sir Khan has a little bit of an upper hand, though. Um, when it comes to uh, French versus uh, the other one, who has to score. This Agro um, is about to go down, but we do see Sir Lose a lot is sending his. He's uh, going around. to be uh, putting some pressure on, but that is uh, that's painful for. Uh, a big fight going on. That denies so much uh, map control. Getting that down, that's really good for them. There's a big fight going on. Purple is uh, coming in. I would like to see uh, Purple age up soon. Uh, send yeah, some Yurumi. And uh, send Yurumi and um, get some Siege Elephants and just uh, go in and take that TC down. I think that would be the play there. I'd be careful with those Soars from Blue. Those, uh, he's going Goons now, so you're going to have to be careful or else you're going to lose all of them. That would not be good. It looks like purple's about to uh, just go all the way in and... Uh, I'm sorry, I, I apologize. It looks like red's about to go all the way in and blue and just uh, try and clean him up as much as possible. Because his army is just so out of position. Um, he did get a few vills. I don't know if it's worth it, though. This will be interesting. So Karasia popped out in the top Callum. And they're going to snag hey. the Sowars. I think these Sowars are going to go down, and then we're also going to see the market go down. At the moment, so Callan and GGW all have an amazing position in this game. I don't think they can lose this. Yeah, I uh, I think that if they lose this game, it will have been a throw. I have... I have no idea, Harrison, what WB stands for. It looks like Evolution thinks it's well blade, but uh, <laughs> well blade. That's uh, that what doesn't I thought make... it was. I thought it was well blade because I said the B might have been an upside down P. So well blade. Yeah. I, I have no idea. It doesn't make any sense to me. It's probably because well Greek to me. WP was taken. So like well played was taken. So he's just put WB. A million IQ. Maybe it's not. Maybe it, I'm really oblivious to it, and it does actually stand or something. And we're both just boomers. Yeah. It's all all great right, we're seeing as a lot more Karasias in queue. Oh, but we hear the Agra firing. That's a big mass. Of um, you say Kurashe is about as uh, terribly as as anyone in the world has ever said. But that's okay. Is it Dude, I believe that's correct. I've been told so many pronunciations. I've, 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 I believe I believe Kirache is the correct pronunciation. Kirache, say it again. Kirache. Uh, okay. Yeah, that's correct. I need a French person to confirm it for me. I've been told like eight different uh, pronunciations, so I've just stuck. Yeah, we need to ask Kaiser Klein because he is the uh, he, whatever he says goes. That's fair. But, um... Okay, so the Kirache. 
Don't, don't be me. Don't be the. Don't give me the there. Uh, um. There, come here. Okay, uh, that is a they lot of side. splash damage and soaking. Uh, how much health do they have right now, the, the Kirshays? Oh, he does have a... Uh, that's a decent... The Kirshays are, are coming in on the... That, oh, the oh, my oh, that God. is so... That is a the most attractive huge. Falcon at Volley I've seen in a long time. They're not even age 4 Falcons. That's, uh, that's really strong. Um... They are stacking a lot of food as a, uh, as it looks. Sir Callum is. Maybe Whoa, he's trying to age. Uh, Sign the 700 gold shipments and he's golden. Um, he is going to lose his Falx. He extended a little bit too much. Those, uh, the, uh, age, the, uh, the TC units, the, uh, Minutemen, or whatever you call them, are gonna take down both Falx. That is painful. Although we say it's painful, but actually Sir Callum's doing a lot of work here. He's doing a massive amount of damage compared to um, to Shaft who's only just started to get into the base. You can see how big a massive is for GGW all uh, they they've got a lot of uh, I'm not sure if uh, Maze Rev is being legit or if he's trying to say slurs. That's uh, interesting. Let's not say it's slower on stream. <laughs> yeah, I'm not. I'm not gonna. I'm not playing on it. Um. Uh, but yeah, it looks like Sir Lose a Lot is just really teetering off now when it comes to score. They, he was keeping up very well with um with purple, but he's just been uh very much yeah he's running his builds now. This is uh this is looking like GG. I wouldn't be surprised if it was over anytime soon. Um, are there any shipments, unit shipments that he can send? I don't think so. I don't think your Rumi would do enough at this point. I think you might have already sent it as well. Uh, this is looking very very good for um. Sir Callan and uh, just, uh, well played all. I would be surprised if this is essentially the end of the game. This yeah, I think it's just kind of uh, Hydraville's time until they're like, yeah, it's actually GG. This is um, not looking good. The amazing thing is, like, from the early fights as well, you couldn't really tell who was going to be around. Where suddenly it felt like one massive yeah. just kind of vanished. It just uh, it just really snowballed. Um, uh, to any mothers that might be in chat, I want to say Happy Mother's Day. Um, uh, it might not be Mother's Day, I guess, where you live. Uh, if you live in uh, no, somewhere where it's uh, it's a new day, if it's a. Uh, uh, Mother's but, Day yeah. was two months ago for people in the UK. Oh, Happy Mother's okay. Day well, to any mothers. Uh, and, 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 uh, in the US, it's the Mother's Day today. But, yes. Yeah, this is, um, it looks about over. I think it's just a matter of saying GG. Or GG Well Blade All from, uh, from Purple. Um. Yeah, you just look at the score lead. It's uh, it's all it's you really need to see. Uh, I really, really want to see someone uh, get the Berber outpost and get their five vills. It's just a free five vills just sitting there for you. But look at the resource income from uh, from Sir Lose a lot. That is painful. There's like nothing. Meanwhile, um, he's stacking so much food. That's uh, that's uh, interesting. Yeah, it's it's over. Uh, yeah, yep. it's called GG. Really good effort by both teams. Uh, yep. It's now 1-1, one, one, is that right? Yes, it is 1-1. One, one. The score is 1-1. One, one. Can we play the post-game so for a moment? Yeah, yes, look at, let's look at uh, post-game. I, I think it'll, I think the, uh, yeah, villager count and unit count um, is just going to drop right about the same time, I think. Uh, military unit population or unit counts, yep. Yeah, that's uh, that's all you really need to see. Um, I think this shows. I, well, I guess I guess Sir Callan also lost all of his army too. But, did, uh, but I don't think but, he lost as much as 
um, so lose a lot whilst over the course of the game. Yeah, it, well, so it's that and losing your vills. Like, you can lose that many if you have your vills to back it up, but use that, what, 20 vills at the very end? That's just extremely, um, not good. Yeah, that's, uh, that's painful. There was never a significant enough raid during this game that caused anyone to lose more than maybe two, say, three villagers at a yeah. time. But this is that... where you can see the settlers dip. Yeah. And this is the thing, so there's a lot of economy seems to be. He was at the most yeah, he was so strong and then he just goes down. That's uh that's very painful. That would uh be GG. Alright, so it's going to go to a game three. I hope you guys are um enjoying the stream. Is this a best of three? Okay. Yes, this is a best of three. So this should be the last game. Let's see what map it's played on. It's 1-1. One, one. Uh, it is 1-1 one, one to unvaccinated. Uh, uh, okay, so... Oh, so they vetoed Han Cairo. That's very interesting. This is Darfur, if anyone's looking or wants to know what map it is. Um, all right, we're getting into it. I... I am intrigued at how they are uh, mirroring sieves. So it seems that it's Russia and Halzar. Uh, Britain and Halzar. Yep. Um, Halsa might be good on this map just because of the natives. They have... Uh, Berbers again, and uh, the TP line is going to be pretty. It's just such a high TP map. It's really good for Hausa. Um, yeah, the uh, student, the uh, what are these, uh, yeah, the Sunar Horsemen and all that. Very good uh, units that you can get out of there. The Sudanese are just very strong when it comes to units. Um, and then Berbers again, you, uh, if you run out of coin, you can get the salt mine. Uh, it does, uh, it does, uh, take a little bit, uh, longer to mine at the same speed, but it's Just checking the general map just to see, just to show it off. Okay, so there's nothing, uh, super interesting in terms of treasures that I can see right now. Um... How do you bring up the chat so you can see what treasures were taken? So, um, oh, I found it. Uh, enter, yeah. yeah. Okay, uh, so uh, there aren't going to be super consequential treasures at the moment. Uh, you really have to go deep into the middle and to the side to get any big uh, uh, tier 3 or tier 2 uh, treasures. But um, the Lion King treasure, that's super funny. You want to read the what the text is for that? I don't this know one? if you've seen it, but it's really funny. Uh, go back uh, to, to the, the Warthog and the Lion. Yep, that one. A uh, written record of philosophical problem-solving uh, <laughs> theory worth a uh, hundred x. It's the Lion King treasure, a warthog and a lion. It's that. really funny. Uh, Akuna Matata, you know. But mm -hmm. it's really funny. It's a good treasure. I love that treasure. Um. Okay, but we see. Um. I really, really do not like. Um, House of Russia as a as a matchup or like together. I pre much prefer Brit uh, Hausa. It'll be interesting to see though. Um, have you checked decks yet? I haven't actually. So uh, this is yeah, we should uh, use a lot of decks. That so looks pretty standard. Um, yeah, there are a few things in there that he could have, but that's for the most part pretty standard, I think. And then we have, um, GD of the okay, so he's going to go a little bit less, I think, um, um, I don't even know. That's interesting. And, uh, okay, so he's got players. team cat scouts. That is interesting. Um, that'll be pretty decent for a house of teammate with a pretty much only cavalry, um, to use. And then you got Sir Callan. What's Sir Callan's deck? 
Sakanan. Okay, that I do not like that deck. Oh, oh. he That's should. Not, uh, um... I do not like pioneers. Why would you have? If oh my goodness, that just makes me so sad. That's not a Brit deck. What is that? <laughs> it's uh, other than pioneers. It seems pretty so, normal, though. Mm, well, kind of. Um, I do not like the double. Um, uh, so that all the cav shipments or all the cav upgrades and all of the musk upgrades. I think that um, you kind of have to pick one, Ready. and you want to get a. Uh, you really, especially, I don't think the team um, Musk upgrade is really all that important in a 2v2. I think if you're going to um, go Cav at all as Brits, you kind of just don't really need it. It's super unconsequential, I think, in this game. Because you do not want to go Musk into um, into Dutch, I think. I think you're probably, I, I, what I'm guessing is this is going to be Longbow um, Javelin Rider versus Javelin Rider... Um, um, Strella, if I had to guess. Um, you already see two uh, outposts um, going up for both players, at two on the TP line, and then uh, one uh, on the TP line and one native scout, or one native TP, so that'll be interesting. Um, That's a Sudanese rather than a Berber's. Sudanese. Yeah, Sudanese. So he could... Um, he could get some uh, buildings from the Sudanese and a few other things. I would have preferred Berbers, but you know, it's, uh, it's, uh, I mean, he's getting it now. So that's interesting. Uh, they are F forward basing in the, in the middle. They're taking all that map, which is really good on this map. There is so much in the middle and on the sides and stuff like that. If you can take the map, it is just so strong. Um, you can already see the, uh, the score. I mean, obviously, um, Russia has a um, really low score usually, but yeah, uh, Animus uh, does not like the nine musk in H three. I don't, I don't like that very much either. I think it's kind of uh, silly, but no. Um, to each we'll throne, I guess. To play. I, I doubt you have so many other. Uh, does he even have? Can you look at his deck one more time? Uh, was it Sir Callens? Yeah. Yeah, it's Sir Callens. Yeah. Uh, he doesn't have long... I would have actually rather the 10 longbow than the 9. Uh, I, I feel like you'll be going longbow a lot more than you will be going uh, musk, at, especially in H3. That's fair. With, fair. But it's okay. We'll we'll see. I think also considering he's against Russia, if Russia was to go strutless... Um, yeah, you really do want to go um, longbows see, in this matchup. You can see that Russia is going strutless, so I think that musketeers yep. is a bad choice here. Yep, you see, you see Huss and uh, Huss and Longbows. I, I, I like that. He is deciding to go Longbows. Um, they are going to take the TP line, it looks. But on this map, uh, you pretty much always get at least one TP on your side because you can't build on it. I think I could be wrong. Um, yeah, it's interesting. He did train some interesting units. Um, yeah, the scores are looking pretty similar. I mean, of course, a Brit is going to have the higher score when you have uh, Russia on the other team, but Russia's score is usually pretty um, deflated, so it should be pretty similar at this point. Uh, Sir Lose a lot is probably going to be claiming that TP pretty soon. He has his explorer right there that he just took down. Um, just looks like yeah he's getting the wood to do that um and it's been pretty i mean besides taking down the tps they've not been super um aggressive um sent berbers that's a uh, in that's not a very good shipment i don't think but you know they uh they can do what they want they are the pros um but yeah this is looking really good for sir callan i i just wish he would have had a uh virginia company in his deck it's so strong on this map you can go out onto the side make a whole bunch of houses uh, secure all those hunts and you're in a really good position uh, i would have much preferred that over um pioneers but we will see he could just be booming so much they have um oh never mind i apologize i'm looking at the at the entire wrong way no they are being um 
really aggressed upon. So this would be interesting to see. I apologize. Um, yeah, blue and yellow really going to uh, apply a lot of pressure. It looks very soon. The longbow mass, I very much like though. Commandment. I do not, yes. I do not like um, the uh, the uh, red going bows as well though. Ready. I think uh, Flani, I just think are bad. Considering the fact that so there's a lot has six Berber camels right here, and there doesn't seem to be a whole lot of yes. any, this could do a lot of work. Yeah, um, I think this is. Uh, and we see Cossack as now. well. Yeah, Cossack, that's a good idea. I think, um... I think Falani are just bad. I think it's a poor play. What's the range on the Falani? Ah, yeah, 17. A they just barely yeah. outrange They have a really Stratus. fast... They have a really fast ranged attack, though. They do. They attack twice as fast as a Longbow with yes. a... Faster animation, right? Or is it twice as fast? No, not twice as fast. It's the same. But longboats have a really like fast faster. animation but too, as long as they're standing. Faster. But I think Falani's you can kind of uh, kite with, but I could be wrong. Yeah, yeah. Terms of rate really of fire, fire is the same. I just feel like um, it's an animation that right? I but... really want to see Sir lose a lot age up, and then send all of his really powerful shipments in age three. I think that that's a good play. They have map control. They have no siege on blue and. Uh, I mean, not sorry. Uh, on purple and red, they they have just all bows. What are they going to do? You can just age up at this point, and uh, you have the uh, TPs. You have everything you really want as uh, as Hausa. I think you can just age. I think you be a little bit uh, greedier. You have map control. You can put a block house on those hunts up in the top, and you can kind of control those. They can't go out. So I think I think that's the way to play, at least on this map. Um, okay, but now you see a whole bunch of Lafiti. Okay, now you can't. You've missed your time to age if you're going to. I think. I think you have to make units now. Um, okay, you want to see what Sir Lose a Lot is doing? What over here? Uh, you, you, like you want to look at? You, you want to switch it over? Oh, um, sorry. Yes. No, you get it. Okay, Sir Lose a Lot. Okay, he is not stacking any resources at all. He is uh, doing a good job of. Uh, of making army. He should probably make a house soon or else he's going to be popped. Yeah, this is uh, going to be a good fight for them, I think. I would have liked um, a lot more anti-cav. I, I said uh, they should not be going uh, Fulani in that. Um, I think after this game, uh, we might be casting a uh, Silver League. I don't know about you, Sedge. I, I think I probably could, but I think we'll take a... Oh, never mind. It's going to be another Gold League. I don't know. Uh, but I need to... We'll, we'll probably take a break for lunch, or I will at least, um, if we do decide to do that after this game is over. Um, I am going to have to find out I'm going to message GK about this. Okay. Because I don't think I'll be able to cast a Silver League. Okay. I, I think I'll be around though, maybe. So, guys, if you uh, see the stream end, it may be up pretty soon after. Uh, again, so don't go anywhere. It might just be a change of cost. Yep. So, really, really just saw uh, GGWB get completely obliterated there. Like, yeah, that's no uh, chance. Of retaliation at all for Sir Cal and his longbows are just not really surviving against cavalry, which is exactly what we both said. There's too much infantry units and anti infantry units, there's not enough to deal with the cav. Cossacks yeah. and the Phoebe Knights are just doing so. Well. Yeah, they, uh, they didn't have any anti cav, that was very poor play from them, I think. I actually think we're just going to see the entire game end here. I don't yeah, see I believe it'll out. probably be over uh, the next 20 seconds, probably. Yeah, I just don't see any way of uh, you coming back against a big nah, stress of mass like that. Yeah. It's, uh, there's no resources um, from 
I mean, a 600 coin, but yeah, I think it's GG. Well, that was a really well to play. Watch into the past, but yeah, we can see that settlers are just uh, going down that thing, right? Trying yeah, to one more stand. they're pulling everything, they're doing the, everything they can just to bolster the uh, kills for yellow, the kill count at the end. It's very nice of them. And he is out. That is. Still waiting for the rest of the Sir Callan is done. Yep, yeah, this is the okay. Uh, that is the last game. <laughs> so Sir Luthalot and uh, uh, Schaff Seckel is uh, are moving on. They uh, yeah, that was just poor. I I think that they should have had a anti cav, but yeah, they just just really plowed through them. That is uh, interesting. I think that. Harrison, are you in the chat? Die. Yeah, to see that many units die in that short space of time. That was yeah, that was um extremely brutal. interesting. Uh, I don't like Flani. That was a terrible play, in, at least in my opinion. You don't really need that. You have longbows. That's going to be good enough, uh, especially longbows. I really, really like against uh, against um, javelin riders and against uh, strelets. They just trade. I mean, longbows are so cheap. They can tr trade well against strelets. They have longer range. They have faster fire. They do so much damage. I, I just would have liked to see. Um, him go uh, javelin. I think javelin rider and um, longbow just beats javelin rider. Um, Strelet. Strelet. Yeah, uh, absolutely. That was. Or you could just choice. make your own calf. Like I don't know. That was uh, interesting to see. I think it was a very odd choice to go for Lani, just because you wouldn't want to go double infantry of the same type either. Longbow is yeah. a skirmisher type unit. Where they're yeah, anti infantry, a... and then so are Falani, they're both archers. Yeah. So, yeah, that, I, was, that was poor, I think. But that's okay. Yeah. It was uh, it was a good game. It was good. Uh, they, it was 2 uh, 1. They uh, they traded games well. It was it was really impressive to see. I just think they had a better Sir Lose a lot and uh, Schaff or whatever, however you say him. Um, blue, and, blue <laughs> and yellow had a better. Um, had a better uh, just uh, idea of what they were going to do. Absolutely. Yep. And I had fun watching that game. They played very well. Uh, both teams did. And yeah, with that, that wraps up the uh, Gold League. However, there is a Silver League um, 